Happy Thanksgiving. I know at least some of you are still cheering after that Vikings win. Thanks for joining us after the game tonight. I'm Maria Lizignoli. Our top story, a new law is considered the largest health care and benefit expansion in the history of veterans affairs. But not every veteran knows it's out there. NBC 15's Michelle Beck has the details on the PACT Act. Michelle, the Madison VA wants people to apply for the benefits and care right now. Yeah, this law is for veterans who served in Vietnam, the Gulf War and post 9-11. It looks specifically at those exposed to toxins during their service from Agent Orange to burn pits. For millions of U.S. veterans, health effects can long outlast their years in service. We continue to see uh, Vietnam veterans uh, having medical conditions. It's why Dr. Ryan Marsh at the Madison VA is shedding light on the PACT Act. Signed into legislation in August, it adds more than 20 medical problems to a list the VA assumes are caused by toxic exposures during service. For example, uh, veterans who had their boots on the ground in Vietnam um, who later developed type 2 diabetes, that's a presumptive condition for uh, Agent Orange and Vietnam exposures and they would get service connection for it. Other now presumptive conditions include brain, kidney and pancreatic cancers, as well as illnesses like asthma and chronic bronchitis. The smoke is just wafting across uh, an area where people were uh, stationed. Burn pits, as Army vet Daniel Connery recalls, are part of the problem identified by the PACT Act. In the recent time, which it was not something that I was deployed to. There are massive burn sites where, you know, trash and other harmful substances are being burned. Also, as Dane County's veteran service director, Connery joins doctors to tell those who've served to check and double check for benefits and care. Unfortunately, sometimes people kind of just exclude themselves thinking that they're not eligible and they may be missing out on things, uh, including health care and disability coverage. The PACT Act also requires the VA to screen every veteran enrolled in VA health care for toxic exposures. So far, the Madison VA says it screened 1,800 veterans in their system, and officials say it's unclear by how much that number will go up. Live in the studio, Michelle Beck, NBC 15 News.